you guys today is monday february 14th um i'm kind of excited for the day i love having like a special day that i can love on my husband a little bit you know a little, just a little bit more you know so anyways um it's about 9 30 i'm actually um i've been up for about an hour but i'm actually headed to go pick up um one of his gifts um so yeah i'm gonna go pick up one everything else probably will come in later but that's fine um so yeah i'm just gonna go pick up something else for him today and then um, and then after when i get back i'm gonna make a brunch so that'll be super cute um i have a bunch of well not a bunch i have a few things that i'm thinking about making um so yeah i have to pick up a few extra ingredients for that i'm about to go to the store now um, after I pick up his gift and then um, I don't really know what all we have planned today um, originally we were gonna go out of town and do like a little um, trip but I have a big event um, at the end of the month so I think we're going to just um, and I have to go out of town for it so with the dog and everything I didn't want to leave like back to back so honestly we'll probably just do something then for like a couple of days while we're out of town um after my event but yeah anyways so we kind of don't really have <laughs> plans for today um we're gonna pretty much just kind of like wing it and see what happens but um i think he's actually kind of got in mind what he wants to do i think we're supposed to get like pedicures later pretty much i'm handling like just up until brunch and then after that i think he has um some things in mind so i think we're gonna do um pedicures today which will be great because i haven't had one and it's probably been too long i don't know maybe a month or so i don't know i don't know it's winter time y'all i don't know but um that and then um my husband actually okay so in our home i am the cook i'm the one who cooks like almost every day so i think he wants to try to cook for me tonight which i'm kind of excited about so yeah we'll see how <laughs> we will see how that goes but yeah i think he's gonna actually cook tonight I, th I think i don't know i think those are the plans and um if not then we'll probably end up doing like dinner or something and then um I think we might go to the movies I don't know he kind of just threw some stuff out there I don't know for sure what the plans are gonna be but overall um, it'll be a wonderful day just to be able to spend time with him all day so um, yeah I love that but yeah what are you guys doing for Valentine's Day I hope you guys are being showered with love um, yeah whether it's you know family friends whoever but I'm gonna go and pick up this stuff and then I will probably see you guys whenever I get back to the house because I'm trying to do this really really quick I'm trying to like be unnoticeably gone for like 30 minutes so um so yeah I need to rush very very quickly so yeah I'll check back in with you guys when I get to the house hey guys so I'm back home um I'm about to get the Valentine's Day started um <clears throat> I went to the store, got this little balloon. I thought this was super cute, just to have pretty much um, sit it up here on the counter. And then, um, ooh, no, come on now, Walmart. Okay. And then, oh, I have to get the most important thing. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So yeah, I got everything that I needed. Um, I got the rest of the groceries that I needed. So yeah, let's get started because I'm starving. I'm hungry. So yeah, let's go. All right, guys. So today's brunch menu is going to consist of um, chicken and waffles, bacon, shrimp and grits. Yeah, maybe some um, potatoes. Yeah, It's a big brunch. We're just going to have brunch and mimosas, of course. So yeah, I'm going to set you guys up and we're going to get started.
drought and famine, natural disasters. My baby has been around for me. Kingdoms have fallen, angels be calling. None of that could ever make me leave. Yeah. Every time I look into your eyes. So I just got done cooking breakfast um, or a brunch or whatever because it's going on it's going on noon. So yeah, I wanted to have it done by noon. It is exactly 12 o'clock. So let me show you guys what I made and then we're gonna eat because I'm starving. <laughs> Hey guys, so it is about two o'clock. Um, we are rushing out of the house because we're gonna go get pedicures. Um, yeah, so we're actually running a couple minutes late. I'm gonna go ahead and go, but I'll probably check back in with you guys whenever I get back to the house. You change overnight. Today is a Wednesday. Um, yeah, it's a couple of days after Valentine's Day. We ended up, um, we had a good time. We ended up just um, chilling though, cause I really haven't been feeling well and I just didn't want to be around people, honestly. So um, yeah, we ended up chilling. Um, and I actually was feeling pretty sick so we didn't get to eat dinner. So my husband actually um, cooked the seafood for me yesterday. And then we had um, the lamb chops today. So freaking good. Um, we actually just ate. So we had lamb chops, potatoes, and salad. It was so good. I'm so full now. Um, and I'm just having a glass of wine. But yeah, I just thought I would check in. Um, today, I haven't done much. Like I said, I'm not feeling good. It's, I actually found out today. It's... Um, my monthly so i was literally thinking like i was sick y'all but it was my monthly this whole time so thank god um 
but yeah so i just pretty much have been resting all day um uh actually i did go get my nails done this morning so these are my nails got like a brown and gold like nude type of thing going on i'm so excited like i think i found a new nail tech i'm so excited because i don't know how long you guys have been watching me but i haven't had long nails in a long time and i prefer excuse me long nails but i just have not had um a good consistent nail tech since i've been here i think i've been through like two or three nail techs already um so yeah did that um and i also went ahead and booked again she gets like booked up really really quick so um oh excuse me so um my next appointment is not until like my around my birthday which is fine um so i'll probably soak these off in a couple of weeks i don't know i'm gonna try to see how long they last she said her clients normally come every like three weeks to like a month so i don't know we'll see i'm not used to that i'm used to going every two weeks but we'll see she did a really good job she's really quick i'm so happy and this like is really out of my comfort zone um like these colors and stuff but i think it looks pretty good this is the other hand so both hands are different but yeah i really really love those um we are uh, we are actually watching Married at First Sight now, though. But like I said, I just wanted to check in with you guys. Um, I'm about to lay back on the couch probably for the rest of the night. Um, I also got this from Target. I think I'm going to put my... Um, for the dishwasher, I think I'm going to put these in here. I think that would be cute. I will have like um I will have like an organization series or whatever soon. Cause I have a bunch of like little organizing things I've been doing around the house. So you guys will get to see that. And I need to finish the house too. I need to finish decorating. So um, I need to start back looking for the stuff that I want. So yeah, looking forward to that. Um, but yeah. I just wanted to check in with you guys. I'm probably about to go. It's like I said, I'm just not feeling well. Um, so yeah, I'll check back in with you guys probably later on this week. I don't know when exactly, but probably sometime later on this week. Hey guys, so today is Saturday. I just wanted to come on and close out the vlog. Um, yeah, so it's Saturday. Honestly, this week has just been like a blur. Um, just because really and truly I haven't done much. Um, like I was telling you guys the other day, um, I think I checked in with you guys later, earlier in the week, but, um, yeah, Valentine's Day, um, I started like, you know, PMSing or whatever. So my little friend came to visit. Yeah. But, um, so I really have not been feeling good all week. You guys, like this was a really bad one. I don't know why. Um, so if you guys have any recommend, uh, if you guys have any recommendations, please let me know. I know I tried this tea one time from somebody and I want to say it like took away my cramps and stuff for at least like two months. Um, so I might try that again because um, this was like the first time it was like really, really like this bad in like a long time. Um, but I'm noticing like as the older I get, like they're getting worse, which is like kind of weird. I don't know. But anyways, um, so yeah. I need to find out I need to find something for that and I really don't want to do like pills I've tried um I don't know I tried like some menstrual pill I can't remember what it was I have it in there but I don't feel like grabbing it anyways I tried it for like two days y'all literally I had like insomnia like I could not sleep so yeah preferably something like natural but um yeah so I've just been like laying down sleep relaxing pretty much the entire week yeah, I really haven't done much, but um, going into next week, which is, yeah, it's kind of good, though, because honestly, next week is going to be really, really busy. Next week, I have to go out of town. Um, I have an event that I have to do in North Carolina, um, a baby shower that I'm going to be, like, decorating and all of that good stuff. So next week is going to probably move really, really fast. I'm going to try to vlog as much as I can um, to show you guys what I do. 
this is my first event of the year you guys so i'm really really excited about this i can't wait um since covid um i haven't like done a lot of events as much so um yeah really really excited about this to get back to work um yeah like i enjoy doing my shop but i like doing events i think more i think i like doing events more so um they're definitely more fun but yeah so i have a lot to do for that um just making sure i have all my ducks in a row and i'm prepared because it's going to move very very quickly i have to like fly in i haven't decided if i'm gonna fly in on thursday or friday depending on how much i get done this week um as far as like how much i have in order we'll decide on whether or not i fly in thursday or friday which whichever one i feel most comfortable with um there's really only one big thing that i have to like prepare that i can only do there so um that's like the main thing i'm just trying to make sure i have enough time to get there to do that um and then of course i have time the morning of the event to put everything together so i mean i'll go into details with you guys with that like next week once i kind of get a game plan for that but yeah so um i'm actually about to cook dinner um and probably just chill for the rest of the evening it's pretty late um but i'm hungry so i'm about to make something to eat really quick before i go to bed um yeah oh by the way um the winner will be announced um in the description box because i haven't done um the generator yet uh yeah so i'm gonna put the names that i have in there for the people who followed all the instructions so let me say this of uh, um quite a few of you guys did like some of the steps but not all the steps so yeah there's that but don't worry we're gonna have more um but like i said um i want to go ahead and just uh pick the winner we'll do the generator thing uh to pick the winner so we're gonna just go ahead and do that with what we have um so yeah next we're on the road to 1000 subscribers i'm really excited about this um I'm trying to find like what my niche is you know i have a lot of things that i do in my work life personal life all of that so i'm trying to figure out exactly what i want to focus on um i know i've said this before but you know i really love fashion i'm trying to get back into that um i don't know if i told you guys but i went to school for fashion so i really want to get back into that during covid it's been kind of difficult i'm not gonna lie because it's like i've become like i think i was a homebody before but during covid it's like i'm really a homebody like i do not like going out on weekends <laughs> um i try to avoid crowds as much as possible like you know so um just getting dressed up and going places um yeah i want to get back to that so that's definitely a goal this year i don't think i shared you guys i don't think i shared my goals with you guys um they're kind of like transferring over from last year to this one but it's cool so yeah um the winner will be announced in the description box i'm like rambling i'm tired y'all um but yeah the winner will be in the description box by the time that this video posts um i just wanted to come and close out the vlog I know it's going to be a short one, but I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, I would show you guys me making this food. I'm actually about to make a shrimp and lobster fried rice. Mm, mm, mm. It's about to be so good. This is going to be my first time making it, so I'm really excited um, to try it. But I don't have no recipe. I'm just, you know, going to go with the flow. So hopefully it turns out really good. Yeah, I thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, turn on your post notifications so you can get it notified every time that I post a video. My goal is to post every Wednesday and Sunday, you guys. So we're working on it. We're going to get there. We're just trying to get in the groove of things. It was like the first couple of weeks I was doing pretty good, but I'm kind of falling off. Like I've had things planned, but I just haven't really been in the space or had the time to do them so um trying to get back on track with that but yeah lots lots and lots and lots of content coming for you guys um yeah so i'll see you guys in the next one